What's up, everybody? Chuck the Biz back with you today, and I'm gonna got a little sauce review um, today. Uh, I picked this sauce up in Michigan when I was up there. I uh, went to the international market, I and mean, they had you know quite a selection. Um, this this one here caught my eye um, for two reasons. One of the simple artwork and, and cleanliness of it, and, and and another reason is right there. Bam, this sauce. Is made in Michigan. Um, this call this sauce is called Rojo. It is a habanero sauce. It has a heat level of five out of six. Um, I don't know who does their judging or their taste testing or what have you, but like I said, they got a nice, uh, nice clean label. Um, we got ingredients of vinegar, chili peppers, corn oil, salt. Contains 2% or less of the following. Lemon juice, maltodextrin, cultured dextrose spices, garlic, xanthan, gum, citric acid. Con contains no reportable allergens. You can contact them online at rojomexicanbistro.com. There it is. rojomexicanbistro.com. Now they had they had another they had a green sauce, and I didn't buy it because obviously it was made out of jalapenos, and I had already had a cart full of sauces. So um, it's got a nice color to it. It's got a it's got it's got a real different consistency looking uh, versus any of the other sauces that I've had so far. You can see it was a little pricey. So I'm going to open this up today, bam, with my giraffe Santuco. Now, there was no harming in giraffes in the, making this knife, but there we go. And I just broke that whole bottle right off. Anyways, that probably wasn't a smart idea. Anyways, I'm going to eat this sauce on some chicken and um, hope I don't get no shards of glass in it. It's got a nice consistency, got a nice orange flavor. And I also am going to eat this sauce into a, in a chip. So here we go. Um, I suggest not opening this with a knife if you do purchase it. Because, yeah, I just fucking cut the top right off that thing. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. The Rojo Red Made in Michigan sauce. It has enough up burn from the halves. Nothing crazy hot. You can taste the vinegar. Adds a nice compliment to the chicken. I'm gonna go ahead and eat this chip. As you can see, it's got a nice orange color to it. I'll give you the pour. You see, it's got a nice silky smooth, a nice silky smooth consistency to it. Nothing crazy hot, nothing over the top. It does have the good flavor though. It has the pepper and the vinegar, average hot sauce. Can't taste nothing else. It does have a real smooth, uh, it does got a real smooth um, consistency to it. Good flavor, balanced heat with the vinegar. 
I can see you can see the, the spices in this. Yeah, man, and don't go buying these uh, uh, giraffe santucos, man. Shit, you see that? that shit cuts glass. Fuck a whack, cut that glass and shit. Whatever. All in all, this is a very tasty sauce. I like it. I would buy it again. I am going to their website, and I am going to check out their other hot sauces. Obviously, I got to buy another one. Like I said, I've never seen this at any other store except for that international market. I have a burn around the mouth, on my tongue. Um, it's got the good had flavor to it. Silky smooth texture and um, good heat. I don't know what else you could ask for in a good hot sauce. Finger looking good, baby. But, yeah, check them out, man. Made in Michigan, right there. Made in Michigan, Rojo Habanero Hot Sauce. Again, you can check them out at RoboMexicanBistro.com. So, I'm going to end this now, get this uploaded so you guys can check it out and maybe check out this hot sauce. So, until next time, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you next time.